Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. I am Natasha Charmaine and if you are new here be sure to go ahead and hit that subscribe button and also hit the like button if you enjoyed this video and to everyone else welcome back. Uh, so in today's video uh, I've got some items that I'd like to share with you. Remember at the top of the year I shared a video on my luxury wish list items that I'd love to have. Um, I actually got in one of those items and um, I'd like to be able to share them with you and give my thoughts. So stick around and watch the rest of this video. All right, so let me just say this. Some of the items that I got, um, pretty excited about, didn't even know I was getting it. One of them was actually a surprise. So this is the purpose of having a wish list so that if other people see your wish list, you just never know, you might be able to get one of the items off your list so that's actually what happened to me I had planned on getting it on my own but um it worked out a little differently but we'll get into that a little later so there are a few items that I wanted to get because you know um, we're starting to wrap up the winter season and um, I'm very much looking forward to the spring and I know you guys are too so one of the items that I definitely wanted to start out the spring season with I got in some stuff from Adidas and um got myself a pair of sneakers and these are much needed i mean i've got a really nice pair of uh white sneakers that are pretty much on the way out and um in the summertime everybody likes to have their white kicks and all that so i'm just gonna start off with the spring get my stuff start early and um hopefully i can maintain them for the spring but um what i did get in are the original Stan Smiths. I've never had these before. I've never had these before. I see everybody with these sneakers. And to be quite honest with you, if you know me, you know that I'm an Adidas girl. I'm sorry. If you know me, you know that I am a New Balance girl. Occasionally I wear Nike, but um, I think I've only ever owned like one pair of Adidas in my entire life. And um, I'm pretty excited about these. They're super white. I mean, like, I'm almost afraid to wear them and get them all scuffed and everything. So I got these in a US size 7. Originally, I had gotten a 7.5, and, a half and um, which is my shoe size now since having the baby. My foot has expanded. I'm now a 7.5. But the 7.5 was too big. So um, I had to send them back. And then I personally went to the store myself tried these on and um they fit really good so i'm pretty excited to wear my sneakers and of course you know i had to get my signature navy blue all right so that's a telltale that these sneakers were for me so that's the first item that i got in i believe these run for like 95 dollars, which isn't bad it's not breaking the bank or anything so i'm excited about this so the next item that I got in, hold on, hold on, Ugh. of course you know I got to get something from J. Crew. I love my J. Crew stuff, okay, it, it just is what it is, okay, and I hope that you guys who are watching love J. Crew too because we do a lot of J. Crew on this channel, okay, so if you don't like J. Crew, this is not the channel for you, <laughs> but um, with the spring coming, I got this puffer. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I love this. This is the signature puffer. It's recycled water repellent. Uh, shell fabric is water repellent. And it's very lightweight and it's slightly insulated. And um, the inside is also my other favorite color, which is green. And I'm in love with this. I couldn't wait to get this. This comes in several colors, um, navy blue, I believe there's a brown and it may also come in black, but um, if you're gonna, if you like something like this, I would suggest getting it soon because I don't think they have too many. Um, but this is perfect. The puffer that I currently have is for the winter. It's quite warm. 
I wear it all throughout the winter, especially on days when it snows and days when it rains, which is why it's perfect, the type of material that it is a puffer. But this one I got for the spring for like 50 degree weather and above. And what's even more is that because in spring, like in April, it rains a lot. This is going to be super perfect for that because it's water resistant. Um, what I love most about it is the pattern of the puff. Usually puffers, you know, they just come in uh, horizontal lines, but this one actually has like some sort of circular pattern. And um, I think that kind of makes it look a little elevated than, you know, your average puffer. So it comes with your zip. Also has um, snaps, so if you prefer not to zip it, you can snap it. And it comes with these two huge pockets on the side. Oh my God, look at this. And as a mom, I need pockets like these so I could stuff a whole bunch of stuff that Milan has in. But I'm so excited to wear this. I'm so excited to wear this. I got this in a size US medium. And um, I forgot how much they retail for, but I'll leave all the information in the description below. I'll also try it on so you guys can see how it fits and uh, what I would style it with. But um, Navy blue, navy blue. And guess what? I can wear all my new sneakers. <laughs> all right, so that's the second item that I got. And we're not doing too much today because I'm really excited about this very, very last item that I have. All right. All right. There we go. I don't know if you can see it. So, this is how it all went down. On Valentine's Day, um, Honey and I and Baby, we went out to a Thai fusion restaurant. And um, we had the, honestly, I'm not good with this. But, you know, in some Asian restaurants, they have a section where you can sit, where you take your shoes off and you put them in the drawer. And you go in and you sit with your shoes off and it's just you and your party and you guys dine in that area with no one else. Well, we opted to do that uh, for Valentine's Day when we went out to, for dinner. And um, Honey presented me with two boxes uh, for gifts for Valentine's Day. And he said, this is how he put it. He said, these are two gifts. One is for you and one is for baby Milan. So you pick which one you think is for you and then you'll give the other one to Milan. Now, I said, okay, one box looked like it was for a kid and the other one looks like it was for a wrap for an adult. So I took the one that was wrapped for the adult. So I opened it and inside were a bunch of Lindor truffles, chocolates, and all pink, uh, foil pink wrapping. And I was like, oh, so cute. Okay, thank you. No big deal. So I gave Milan her gift and um, it was wrapped in like this child like box you know for a kid and so I said well let's open her gift for her and I opened her gift and there was a box in there and um, I said okay what'd she get so I opened the second box and there was a green box inside and I couldn't believe what I was looking at long story short I had the footage for all of it I had the footage for all of this and I lost it I was actually gonna put it in in this video to show you guys the shock on my face when I realized what I was looking at and I lost it all. So in hindsight, this is the box that I was staring at in awe when my mouth was wide open. <laughs> this is it. All right. And um, when I tell you, I was just so excited. I, I didn't even expect it. I didn't expect it at all. Okay. So this is what we got. Anyways, <laughs> enough about the footage. Let's open the actual item. Yes. So for Valentine's Day, honey got me my Gigi earrings and I'm so excited I'm so I'm so so grateful so humbled so excited so just so and um 
I'm super excited to wear these. These are the interlocking G Gucci earrings and um, they're in the sterling silver. And to be quite honest with you, see this is why you pay attention. <laughs> I love him to death, I do. But these are not the actual earrings in my wish list. But he thought they were, which is what counts. So I'm gonna try these on. And I want you to see why these were not the earrings. I'll actually link a video of the um, wish list so you guys can take a look and tell me what you think. But this is the earring. I hope you guys can see it. Or maybe I'll just try it on another time and show you guys what it looks like. But um, what happened here is that you see how big they are? They're huge, right? And I'm kind of thinking they might be too big for my ears because as you can see, I barely have a lobe. It just connects straight to my neck. And um, the ones that I want were a little bit smaller so let me know in the comments below what you think should i just go on ahead and keep these or should i exchange them for the smaller one i'm so excited i mean i can just imagine having a conversation with someone you know what i mean they're just so big and i'm like huh I'm sorry, I didn't hear what you said. What was that? <laughs> From afar, they kind of look like pearls. You know, like they're big enough that they could look like pearls just dangling in my ear. But I was looking for something a little bit more subtle. Because um, I am a very subtle person. I don't like to be in your face with what I have. If I have on something that's of luxury or that is luxurious. I know it and those around me who are familiar with the quality of luxury and knows what they look like would know it but I don't need to shout it in your face I'm wearing Gucci earrings you know it's just it is what it is and it is what it is but um ooh, darling darling ooh, I love them I do so yeah you guys let me know what you think should I keep these or should I go on ahead and um just exchange them for the ones and I'll put up a picture and show you exactly which ones um, I was talking about that I wanted to get originally but um <sighs> your girl is happy she's very happy <laughs> so yeah so those are my recent ins uh, new in and you know what I think it also came with comes with a card well, it's just a thank you card. No big deal from Gucci. Uh, so yeah, those are my new ins, and um, I'm really excited about wearing my earrings. Even if it's not going to be these, I'll just have to wait a little bit longer if I get the other ones. But again, let me know what you guys think. And um, I thank you guys for stopping by and opening some gifts with me and unboxing. And um, I'll see you guys in my next one. You just never know what I'm going to have next, so just stick around, you know? Thank you for watching.